We begin tonight with a look inside the Mid-State Fair in Paso Robles. News Channel reporter Tony Almanza takes us to a celebration of the local agriculture community where farmers and ranchers received best of the year awards. 1,400 people showed up to the Cattlemen and Farmers Day at the Paso Robles Event Center. This is really a homecoming for Slow County Agriculture, so we're gathering with all of our neighbors and cattlemen and Farm Bureau and cattle women's Farm Bureau women. It's really a celebration of what makes Slow County so special, and that's our local agriculture community. So this tradition actually dates back to 1963. The hope of this event is to pay tribute to the local cattlemen, cattle women, and agriculturalists. This is really a volunteer effort, so it's cool to see uh, you know, your old family and kids and friends and neighbors, and this is really where we kind of get to see each other once a year. Three farmers and ranchers from across San Luis Obispo County received Best of the Year awards. It's a great honor to be uh, a cattle woman of the Cattle Women of the Year 2023. There's a lot of ladies before me that have gone back many, many years, and they are uh, special, and they have also gone uh, and helped out with the beef industry. They say agriculture is essential to Slow County. This gets a chance to showcase all their community outreach, all the things they've done for agriculture, their success in the business of agriculture, but really it's to remind our you know, fellow neighbors and the public that agriculture is a signature industry here. Award recipients say being in the cattle industry means a lot to them. I enjoy being with the ladies in the cattle women um, group of us and we are uh, promoting uh, the, the beef industry for cattlemen. We work alongside them and we promote beef in, in the industry. In Paso Robos, I'm News Channel reporter Tony Almanza.